Hi YouTube, this is Paulette with Love Skin Hair and Garden um, in South Carolina. Um, what I'm doing in my garden, I figure it may help someone. Um, just preserving my mints. Um, I already did my spearmint. Um, I did my chocolate mint. I did my pineapple mint. Here's my apple mint and this is my mojito mint and over here I have a woven basket with the mints I just mentioned, the pineapple, the spearmint and the chocolate mint. Then I have a, another basket here. I have my cutters and this is my apple mint and my mojito mint and what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna prune it away both of them actually I'd probably do one at a time starting with the apple mint I'm gonna add it to my other mints and then I would have liked to dry them on the the, the basket but I don't have a cover I know I have a mesh somewhere but I can't think of where it is so what I'm gonna do is when I finish cut it up and everything is in there I'll put the mint blend into these brown bags and let it dry so I'm gonna cut the apple mint and then I'll come back okay so I cut my apple mint I don't have a specific way to cut it I don't know if there's a right way or wrong way but my goal was just to cut away all the Cut it level, as pretty level as possible. Then I'll probably go back and remove the branches that look, that are not green. But what I do now, I take the best parts. I take, I'll take off the seed head. Um, I really don't want the seed head. So I'll take this off. I'll take off this part. Um, I'll put that in my compost and I'll just take the best here. I'll discard all this bottom part, the yellows, the, if it looked like any inset, any brown specks, I'll remove that. And I'll just take the ones that, to my eyes, look pretty perfect. So that would just be probably this top part and I'll cut it up and I wouldn't want this one or this one and I'll probably take these two baby stems and pretty much you'll see the gist over here is probably mostly the just the best parts so there's no disease looking leaves or brown specks it's the best ones. Okay, so I'm going to do the apple mint and I'll be back. Okay. Just in case this video cuts off, I wanted you to see what I took. Um, there's no browning, there's no insects on this. I'm going to add it to my other mints. I'm probably just going to chop it a little bit more. Um, take off these leaves and just use the top part. And this is what I discarded and pretty much the leaves are already in here that I didn't want. So just in case the video cuts out, I just wanted to give you an idea, but I'll probably just do another part of, right, so what I did, I cut this, so probably if I don't want the stems, just cut off the leaf and pretty much get rid of this and I'm left with just uh, mostly green some stems but not too much um, pretty much just cut them up and just in case the video cuts out as I said I'll come back with another part when I'm finished I have all the mints and I'm ready to put them in the brown bag if the video doesn't cut out, I'll come back when I'm cutting up the mojito mint um, just to show you the different mints that are going in. Um, if it cuts out, thank you for watching and I'll see you in part two.
Okay, I'm back. I finished the finished the apple man, and this is what I got.